I'll do this. I'll cover it up there. Well, how did first day go? You know, I thought we had some fun, good fundamental work, but I really wasn't pleased with our. Uh, I don't think we finished the practice real well. I think we got to pick up our intensity. I think it's co coaches, players. We need a better day tomorrow. Uh, Alcius, I know y'all moved him to left tackle mm -hmm. in the spring. What, what yeah. do you like about him? Just an athletic pad. You know, he can move his feet. He's got, he's got long arms. He can move his feet. Extremely athletic. So but he's that guy. We think we uh, so we can take that image. Uh, how limited is that? I know DeMichael wasn't. Uh, DeMichael we rested him. He, he's he's going to be ready, but. We're going to rest him for about a week or so. Just ankle or something? He just, he just got a little, he just kind of, little, little strange. It's nothing, nothing probably as well as we with receivers. We can take a little bit of caution with him. Coach, what inspired you to do some sprints there at the I always try to. I do my geriatrics <laughs> twice a week, so I got to, it allows me to get out there and get my, Whatever you want to call it, work out of him. So try to get a little blood running. Looks like quarterbacks look pretty sharp on some passes out there. Yeah, yeah, we're, that'll be a fun battle. I think Quadro's looking good today. He got healthy. I thought he made a few good throws. I thought he played Jag. Uh, Fate, you know, he, he delivered the ball well. Uh, he went in there and I thought Carcello might be a good chunk. So we just got to keep battling there. But that's like I said, that's going to be that position that we just keep keep battling out at every day. You know, just see how that. Get through a couple scrimmages and see if we get any numbers. What are you looking for in those guys to stay just, just run the offense. I mean, we're going to kind of quarterback. Uh, make sure we're doing, you know, executing, putting us in the right plays, and, you know, put the ball where it's supposed to be. You know? and so, for those guys, again, I think we're talented at that position, so it's going to be a fun battle to watch. When you, um, when Trace popped him when y'all were going out recruiting him. Did you think that he would be able to play you never, this quickly? You never do as a freshman. You, ne you never have that assumption that a freshman's going to come in and start a center. Uh, but the reality, being a coach's son, you know, and Tommy raised him, he's coached him his whole life, and just being a coach's son, he's way ahead of the curve. So uh, strength-wise, he's way ahead of the curve. Uh, so yeah, he's physically and mentally ready to play. You got to give old, old dad a lot of credit on that one, too. Sherrod right, sure, coming off the injury. It looks like he might have put on some pounds and pulled up a little. Yeah, he did. I thought, I thought, you know, I really thought uh, Sherrod moved well today. I thought uh, thought all our linebackers, uh, I thought uh, Ruff, I mean, not Ruff, but I thought Walden was, and Ruff were working together today. I thought they did some good things on that side. And I also thought Jeremy and the team were good. I, we're deep at that position. I mean, if we stay healthy there. We got, we, got, we got some guys that are really good. So, uh, and they got a lot of experience, so it's a good thing. Uh, you know, I thought Tyree moved well, too. I was watching him today. He did some really good things. I like Tez had a good day today. I thought he ran the ball well. Uh, pleased with him. Uh, so, all in all, you know, certainly up front, it's hard to tell a lot with the D9 over and over short. So, we're not really, you know, it's kind of pity pat inside right now. But it'll, that'll pick up the next few days. Picasso's experience showed up. Yeah, I thought Picasso had a good day on the perimeter. Uh, he, he did. I, I thought uh, I, I was pleased with him. Uh, guys like Ray Sean and Ty, I thought they had a decent day. I, I go back and watch film and make sure because I was all over the place and we were doing two games. You know, but, but I was pretty pleased with those guys from what I saw. Going back to Quadre, how, how tough was it for him to miss the spring, and then how happy are you? I, I, you know, I think he'll, I think he'll be bound. You know, I do. It's just like everything. I, I'm, a, I believe in competition. You know, I just do. I just think, you know, you gotta, you gotta come back in and compete. You know, that's one of the tough things when you do get injured. You open up windows. You know, I don't care if you're in the NFL or you're in Pop Warner. You know, that's why. Guys are always trying to take care of the body and stay healthy, especially when you get to the pros because you're sitting in the tub and guess what? Another guy comes in and gets an opportunity. And if he does good, you know, all of a sudden you got a battle on your hands. And I think that's the tough thing whenever you're injured. You know, you're sitting out there and another guy's getting those reps and he's getting a chance to prove himself. So, you know, competition's good. Uh, it's good at quarterback, it's good at linebacker. I mean, everybody talks about the quarterback, but I look at our linebacker situation too. I mean, we got four really good football, I'm really more than that. but. We got really probably at six, and we got some competition there, so it's fun to watch those guys battle. Yeah, the linebackers, it's going to be tough to leave some of those guys out in the game. You know, but they'll all play. They always do. We'll rotate them. 
I mean, I, I consider ourselves to have probably four starters. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I say two, and I think we got some NFL talent at that position. You know, we got some moves, so the bottom line is we just got to let them play and I always talk to them. It's what you do on that field that counts. So get out there and when you get your opportunities, make it work. Put your product out there and make it count. Carswell was the only guy that Anything else? Thank you.